Hey, what is up heroes and welcome back to more Pokemon Solar Light and Lunar Dark. Last episode we explored the Safari Zone and we caught this cutie pie right here. Chi Trick, my... Ooh, thank you very much for the Hyper Potion, appreciate that my man. Uh, my favourite new Pokemon in this game. It is absolutely adorable. Electric, Dark type, it just... It looks like Zero Aura, and Zero Aura is like my second favourite Pokemon at the moment and it just... Ah, oh, dude. Had to catch this for the team. Replace Rooshop. I mean, I did love Rooshop, but this thing's just... It's just cuter. It really is. So we're going to make our way to Lake Bliss next. And can we... Yeah, I say surf across here. Quickly grab this. Sleep talk. Is there anything else we can grab around here real quick? I think this is it. Oh. Smock one. Okay. Just going to take this out because we do need to do a little bit of training. Because obviously we've got Paracy on the team. We put Barul on the team and Chi Trick now. We've lost half our team <laughs> from, a, from a couple episodes back, so we're a lot weaker than we were. Which, it sucks, but hey, at least we've got some new team members to use. And ooh, what is around here? Just Lumberry. Nice. For a split second, I thought I was going to find some like, really cool secret area, but just a Lumberry. That's yeah, okay. Let me quickly heal up as well. Because we took a little bit of damage. We don't like that. Uh, let's see. Cookie gained 150 HP. Perfect. Alright, let's continue on. Route 12. Hello. What's an apple right there which we need to pick up? The Hay Barrel Ranch is an awesome place to work. It looks it to be honest. Looks really cool. Apart from when you get Team Solar trying to steal some of your Pokemon. That one seems too fun. Alright, but we're level 39. We should be able to take this out. Let's go for a knockoff. Oh, that damage is so nice. Low on my speed, okay. Got our speed ya. I think Chi Trick is probably gonna be the fastest Pokemon in this game, from the Pokedex entry anyway. It seems like this thing is super duper fast. So I'm not worried about any speed drops at the moment. Okay, that's kind of annoying. Let's try a shockwave. Okay. Critical hit. Okay, that sucks. That's fine, it's fine. Uh let's go. I want to try and get my whole team to level 50, so I'm not going to use Flero for a little bit, unless we really have to, because obviously the Pokemon will battle around now, like right about here, or about, you know, just coming on to 40, and uh, we are, you know, hitting 50, so we need to be very careful and get too OP. It's kind of a good thing I did, like, get some new team members, because I feel like if I didn't, we would definitely be super OP. <laughs> And it's better to be, you know, a little bit OP and a little bit not. Because it kind of balances out a little bit. Than to be just super mega OP. But Lake Bliss is just up, not up, just up here. I thought it would be up here. Gets a little bit further up. And then, yeah, oh, apple again. Can we check how many apples we have? Uh, I don't think so. No. Like we must have like at least six or seven now, so maybe once we get to the next town, I'll just fly back to Coralite, speak to the old lady, and see if you know we did pick up enough apples. But she lost seven, and I need to switch out because I can't hit you with Faro, and this thing's actually pretty scary. All right, I'm confused, but my tech's super duper high, so I think it is. And I'm gonna hurt herself. Ouch. Nice. Okay, critical hit. If I have myself again, this is looking bad. Whew! Alright, one more Fire Fang. Snapped out of confusion. Perfect. I feel like we might battle Kira as well soon. Because she's going to be a Lake Bliss, so I need to make sure I'm healthy. So I'm going to quickly heal up. Uh, cookie. Cookie and then need a revive. Do I have no more revives? Rival herb, that'll do. Wait, what? Could have sworn I selected a revival herb, but <laughs> I guess I didn't. Anyway, all right. Let's now go up to. I like how its tail wags left and right. <laughs> right, collect bliss. Anything in here? Empty.
Hey, what up? Ah, it's you, Volti. Come over here. You have to see this beautiful lake. It's alright. Do you know about Lake Bliss? I do not. It's a man-made lake made over a hundred years ago. It was made by a guy who wanted a safe and peaceful place for people and Pokemon to come to. Over time, the lake grew more beautiful. Lots of Pokemon came and now it's blooming more than ever. Have a look around, I'm sure you'll love it. I think I'm going to go to Green Pine City. There's a gym and I heard that the leader is using grass-type Pokemon. Maybe we'll meet again, bye. Alright, sounds good. So the next leader is grass-type then, and that should be uh, should be easy for us. We've got an ice-type, we've got a fire-type. So that should be good. Apparently there's a wild parafox here. A lot of people have seen it roaming around. It comes up to trainers sometimes, but vanishes instantly. I wonder what it's looking for. Fire fox? I have no idea what that is. The lake is shaped like a heart. That's so cool. Aww. We'll surf across in a second. I'm just going to check out the left side. And then we're, uh... Oh, he's so cute! I have to catch him. He looks so sad. I just have to capture him, man. Don't be so sad, dude. I kind of want to use him now because he just, he's just so sad. Dude. He's so cute. You don't have to be sad. I will capture you. And you can play with all the Pokemon in the box. Sound good? And I will friend ball you as well so you know that I'm your friend. Okay, I'm going to have to do some damage. I was hoping I could just catch it and bam. So used to like, let's go Pikachu and Eevee just throwing the ball. Or even Pokemon Go just throwing the ball and trying to capture it and yeah. Although that's not gone well today. Did it. Uh, three Polkia raids with four accounts, and I only caught three out of the twelve. It, it did not go well. Polkia hated me today. I'm gonna go for a shock wave. Uh, I don't think I'll kill it. Yeah. That's it. It seemed kind of bulky. Just wanna catch this little cutie. Okay, next Pokemon. Come on. No! Why do you hate me when I show you nothing but love? Come on. It's gonna be your friend, man. I want you to be happy. Alright, I'm gonna try a netball because it's water. Hey, there we go. When I get to the next town, I definitely need to buy some balls though, because we are getting quite low. Oh, it's so what a fairy. Uh, Publash weeps at the nearest provocation, uh, crying for long enough that a large puddle would form around it. Tears have been said to be incredibly bitter. Aww. Makes me so sad, but I'm glad we caught one. I'm just gonna stop myself from capturing all the ones I encounter now, because. Oh, that's so cute! So cute. Okay, right, left side. Let's go check this out. And then we can go surf in the middle. Oh, more shots, they're so cute. I do like them, but Thermal Paracy. This place is so magical and peaceful, I can see where it gets its name from. It's so blissful. Mm hmm. Ooh. Big journeys begin with small steps. Wait, what? Oh. Oh my god. That's so cute. I wish I saved it. I really wish I saved it. Um, I haven't got any balls. I was getting it might just run away because that's what the person said. Don't run, don't run, don't run. Okay, it's staying, it's staying, okay. Uh. Oh. Is it ghost type? If it is, um, for Robe, you might just get replaced. Okay, so, the last save point I had was a little while ago. The start of this episode, actually. So I'm just going to quickly go and um, redo this, get here again, save it, have some balls, and I'm going to capture this bad boy. Alright, we're back trying this again. Just gonna give it some shockwaves. Ooh, okay, just one shockwave will do. 
and then we are gonna go for some ultra balls. I think I bought enough. This thing is so cute. I need it. Oh, come on. Don't be like that. Don't be like that, boy. Great, ultra ball, come on. No. Why? Critical hit. Okay, that's fine, it's fine. Got plenty more ultra balls. I can capture this. And I saved it as well, just in case. No, I thought I had it then. I was so close. So very close. Come on. Alright, Fox, I believe in you. You want to join the team. Apparently not this ball, though. Come on, man. Be, be cool. Be cool. Come on, dude. Yes, we got it. Oh, dude, this is so cute. Is it, pure, is it just pure ghost type? Normal ghost, oh, okay. Presence of power fox is unusually weak. Even for a ghost type, sometimes it may flick in and out of reality for a split second. All right, that is going on the team. I mean, Farobe, I do love you, boy. I really do. I love Faroe, but I'm sorry, that power fox is, it's normal ghost and it's cute. General rule of thumb in this game, if you're a cutie pie, you join the team. 100%. Gotta check out the right side as well, mind plate, cool. My team is just full of cuties. <laughs> just realised, look, <laughs> look at Cheetrick just running across the water. Oh my goodness. Oh, Faroe? Oh. Cheetrick was not supposed to be out then, was was she or he? I can't remember what gender it is, it doesn't matter. Right. Let's go down and we are gonna make our way to the next town. We're gonna battle a few people as well. Uh Fast Gold. Yo! If I win, you'll do do my work on the fields, okay? No! <laughs> I would love it if a Pokemon game actually did something like if you lose to this guy and you try to go and pass him again, he's like, yo, you can't leave until you do my work. You have to go back to get to the ranch and then just, you know, move something or something. Just, just a, you know, I think really, really stupid. It would probably annoy a lot of people. It would annoy me if that happened, but <laughs> it's kind of funny. Right, uh, Cyphlock. Okay, little ice thing. Join everyone, dude. Alright, there's another apple there. So this has got to be the last one. Yeah, found all seven apples. Tells you, good. So when we get to the next town, I'm going to fly back just because I don't want to, you know, run all the way back through Route 11 and 12 just to get here. I can just fly back to uh, the next town, you know? Makes life a little bit easier. Alright. Uh, oh, what's up here? White herb, nice. So this is Sailport Town. Okay, where's the Pokemon Center so I can heal up? And put Parafox on the team. Pokemon Center, where you at? Probably at the very top. There it is. Alright, let's get nice and healthy. And Parafox, you can go on the team. So cute, man. Illusion. It's not like Zorak, is it? Illusion ability like that, because that would be pretty cool. Yes, it is. Okay. Very cool. And there's two side quests here. Hey, you're a trainer, aren't you? I'm searching for a trainer who can show me the free emotion Pokemon. Pupedal, 
Papyro and Poplash. Oh, I haven't got Poplash anymore because I reset the game, but yeah, I mean, we know what one of them is at least. Ah, someone who can satisfy my greatest wish. Somebody told me about a water Pokemon which has different colours depending on the gender. The male one is blue and the female one is pink. That's gotta be the mer man or mer woman? Wait, mer mermaid. Yeah, mermaid and merman. <laughs> I was like, mer woman. It's like, wait, where am I going with this? Merman and mer mermaid. Yeah. So let's fly back and we can go hand this quest in over here. And I wonder what we get for it. There's this old lady here. Fear of I'll give you this. Wide lens. Oh, okay. Cool. And, uh, yeah. Let's get back to the cell port. So where are we probably going? Probably, uh, Rassic City is there. That's where we'll be going next. That actually seems kind of cool. We've got a lot of a lot of places to, st to uh, still explore, which is kind of cool. How many badges have we got? Five. Yeah. So much more to explore. Right, let's go explore this town. This town reminds me of my hometown. You won't have heard of it. Okay. You don't know that. <laughs> There's a legend about a ship that was attacked by a giant Lisquid. The ship sank and lost all of its treasure at the bottom of the ocean. No one knows what happened to the treasure or where it went. Or well, a giant Lisquid. Okay. There's also another legend of a white Humbridge that swims in Route 12. Although I've never seen it, I've heard stories from people who have. Oh. Sounds cool. Uh, let's go talk to you. I'd like to share my knowledge with young trainers who train water type Pokemon and help them because become the best they can be. Yes, you have a water type in your party. Great. Here, take this. Splash plate. Oh. So I'm guessing if I show the woman in Coralite Town, the flying type when we get one, we'll get the flying plate. Love your Pokemon, they look strong. To fill your Pokedex, I have something for you. I think we have a Dust Stone, so I'll take a good Dawn Stone. Thanks. I want an Air Stone, though, that would be great. I can find one of them. I fish up a few Hamul. These Pokemon are a bit vicious. Okay. No idea what they are, but they sound very cool. Sorry, I don't have time to talk. I'm watching the daily fishing contest, which I got second place in. Right, let's check out this house. What's up? My boyfriend is such a dreamer. He wants to battle, battle the Elite Four, but he forgot that he just has three badges. Everybody knows that you need eight badges to take part in the Rokoto Championship. After winning it, you can battle the Elite Four. Oh, okay. That sounds fun. This town is the best place to live. Rex, one of the Elite Four, comes off comes often from Rassic City. Next time I will meet him, and I want to battle him, and you'll get absolutely wrecked, mate. An Elite Four member versus a trainer who has three gym badges? Ain't gonna go down well. And if you watch my Renegade Platinum Nuzlocke, you'll know exactly how that goes down. <laughs> I think I had three gym badges at the time, then the bug type dude was like, yo, let's have a battle, and I'm like, okay. And then yeah, he, uh, he just destroyed my whole team. It was... It was horrible. Oh! Yo! Ah, it's you, wimp. Long time no see. So, you're heading to Rassic City. I told you that's my hometown. There's no place for a weakling like you. Ha! <laughs> I'm going there too. I'm gonna battle Rex. He's one of the Elite Four. If I can beat him, I'll be one of the best trainers in Makoto. But first, how about we battle? I'm gonna test out my new Pokemon. Are you ready, weakling? I am. Bring it on, Rick. Like battle music as well. Right, for goo, ooh, that's cute. Uh, I'm gonna go for a crunch. No idea what type that is, but crunch will do. And I'm guessing you're part poison. Okay, it's fine. One more crunch. I think we should still outspeed it. It's nice. I'll switch out after this. Uh, Dino, Dino Peon. Isn't it the fire type? I feel like I know what it is, but I'm gonna go into Floro just in case it is what I think it is. The name Dino makes me think of a dragon type, but yeah, it's this thing. I think it says fire. Could be fire dragon now. 
for a Dusty Dash. Or not, I don't know what type this is. I was sworn that the first evolution was part fire, but I could be wrong. Either way, taking it out now. Uh, Nidoron. I have no idea what his Pokemon are, man. So that could be a flying type? Oh, I was definitely wrong. Okay. Uh, let's switch. Heresy, let's go. Eight. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ouch, okay, it's fine. Let's go for a Mega Drain. I think that's where you take me out. Yep, it's alright coming. Okay. I think before we leave this town, I need to do some grinding bad. Okay, it's not good. Five arts, oh, fine. Gets a six or higher, yeah, we're dead. Oh, we lived? I was not expecting that. I thought a six or higher would just kill me. Uh, Spring, that's gotta be water type named Springin. The Chi Trick? No, that's the bug. Oh, yeah, we're switching out because we are hot dog. Uh,. Go husk old. You turn, that's fine. Ooh, critical hit. That ain't good. Okay, that's a steel type, definitely. Steg of steel. That looks cool, it really does. Alright, flamethrower will hopefully take you out in one hit. No Malak will have sturdy. Or not. Nice. Bring on that bug again, yeah. Let's burn it. Nice. His team, like, I have no idea, like, his team. However, that sounds like it'd be a flying type. Hopefully. <laughs> Being wrong, like, about every single one of his Pokemon so far. Yeah, this is this is fine. Alright, Shockwave. Nice. Crush Core, yeah, we can live that easy. One more than I thought, actually, to be fair. Whew. I'm still better. No, you're not. I beat you, like, every single time. Drap. Guess these new Pokemon need more training. I reckon I can find stronger Pokemon in the ancient past. To get to Ras uh, Rassic City, you have to get through there. You shouldn't come to Rassic City. I think you're too weak for this city. <laughs> Catch you later, loser. But I beat you, like, 20 times. Oh, Rodney, hey. Hey Voltsy, another battle against the red hair? I hope you'd won. <laughs> Professor Pinewood called me and said I should tell you that he is waiting for us in the Pokemon Center here in Sailport Town. Kira will be there too. The professor sounds really anxious. I think he'll give us new information about Team Solar and Team Luna. We will wait, we will waiting, we will be waiting for you at the quest floor of the Pokemon Center, Voltsy. See you soon. Alright, see ya. Uh, okay, so can't do that. Oh yeah, I have to go here first. Okay. Wait, unless I can go down here? Yes, yeah, so I can leave this area and train, which will be good. Just can't go any further. In the quest center, which is good for us. Because we can heal up. And I'm going to be ending this part right here. So I can do some serious grinding. I'm going to get our whole team to level like 42. So, you know, that includes... Parafox, Baul, and Paracy, and Cheatrick. Uh, where's the Lucky Egg? I should really give that to you. Uh, did I not take Lucky Egg off anyone? Or is it on Huskold? Yeah, there it is. Alright. Yeah, we've got some grinding to do. So I'll be doing that off screen. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.